slime and I bang it up. We banging a wind up. It's red and we pour it up. My diamonds, they glowing up. She waiting, she wanna fuck. Be patient, I'm counting up. Alright, what is up, guys? RV stuff back here once again. And today we're gonna be taking a look at another pair of these Travis Scott Air Force One lows from this time they are from yes kicks over there um you already know i've been rocking with yes kicks for just over two years now i want to say something like that um quite a long time but anyways not trying to make this video too too long let's just get right into it these took about a week to get here um came double box of course you can see the box condition is a1 um what else yeah that's pretty much it for that um I was gonna say some other shit. Oh yeah, if you're new to the channel, of course, subscribe. If you like what you see, drop a like, turn on notifications, follow the Instagram, link is always in the description, of course. And yeah, just, of course, enjoy the video. So, excuse me if I sound tired, I am pretty tired. Um, just wanna enjoy the rest of my day off, trying to get through these videos, so bear with me here, y'all. Anyways, let's get into it. Uh, if you guys don't fuck with UA shoes or rep shoes, it's easy as getting off the video. Simple as that. No one hate needed, of course. So there's all the information for y'all to use. Don't condone any of this, but you guys do what you want with your money like I do with mine, like I always say. So there's a website, yeskicks.cn. Email is right there, service at repkicks.cn. WeChat is rep at repkicks. And then if you use the code RV stuff on anything on the site, you can save yourself $15 off. And of course, if you make a video for them, you can save yourself $50 off. I believe that's a deal they have. Um, so yeah, do that stuff, do that stuff. So put the shoes to the side, put that to the side real quick. And uh, let's take a look at the box. You can see it says the nice updated Cactus Jack box. They're supposed to be coming in these days. Um, if you look back on the first pair of reviews, I believe they were from Shoe Out. I got the like, super super like early pair so i mean the box was all it was just like a regular air force one box that the travis scott lows came in before um so yeah definitely upgrade on the box you know you get that if you wait of course but sometimes i want to pick up the kicks real real early so i like getting uh whatever i get i'm not wearing the box at the end of the day so it don't matter to me but that's the top of the box inside you got the tag shack uh paper so it says the updated paper you're supposed to get as well with this. Um, you got the sticker right here as well. Nothing else for inside the box. If you guys saw my last review, I don't know when I'm gonna be uploading this, so it might. So this might be the first review, but I did review another pair recently. Um, if it's not up yet, it will be up after this one sometime. But of a pair that didn't have the updated paper in the box and the tag was not also not updated, but. The pair of shoes was still straight, so that's all that matters. And of course, you can always ask the sellers. You can always contact them and ask them to give you the updated stuff. And if they have it, they will give it to you for sure. So, just like StockX stuff, if you want that sort of stuff, make sure you ask for it for sure. So, here's the tag. You got the colorway, multicolor, muted bronze, Air Force One Low Cactus Shack, size 11. You got a little QR code right there. It says RFID just a retail price so yeah that 160 yeah 160 um nothing else got some nike branding on the bottom of the box it says cactus jack records and some weird ass text over there just like how it's all over the paper on this side you got the cactus jack in like a dark dark brown it looks black in the video but it's like a dark brown um you see cactus jack and like weird ass lightning same with this side, it's in brown, you got the Cactus Shack face right there, so um, blue Nike on the top. Nothing else for the box, ladies and gents, so let's take a look at the shoes, of course. Here they are, in all their glory, give you guys a little zoom out, y'all check them out right there, just a little overview. So like I said in my last video, I'm going to just keep it real with y'all, these shoes, quality is mad nice on them. For real so if this is a seller i mean yes kicks usually puts out solid quality shoes so i'm not even gonna front with y'all like usually they're their stuff solid for sure so you guys can just check the detailing out for yourself it's gonna say less and do more by just giving y'all close-ups of all the little parts of the shoe you can see a nice suede on the front 
got some more hairy suede right here with some new buck in the like gray green color uh, got all the different prints right there as well with the tan swoosh Texas on the back lime green or like mint stitching for the midsole as well gum bottoms you already know Low wool on the back, stitching A1. On this side, same deal, different prints. With the camo swoosh this time on this side. Got some corduroy in black. And then we got corduroy in like burgundy, I guess. Kind of shows as brown in the video, but it's more burgundy. Um, with the leather on the front. Nice like gray leather. So. It's actually really nice quality leather for real uh, of course with these you do have the zippers i was getting itchy because i'm i'm in a hoodie right now and it's all it's getting all warm so i gotta rush through these reviews but you got the little zipper jacket thing um one way to style these shoes guys this pair specifically didn't come with them but uh, most pairs these days if you order should even from yes kicks honestly they should come with a pair of cream laces as well um, so actually not nah, these did these did come with a pair of cream laces sorry I'm, I'm tripping these did come with a pair of cream laces I just took them and decided to use them with my pair um, the person I got these for doesn't really mind so it is what it is took them decided to use it for these pair or uh, for my pair of these and they look a hundred times better with them because this burgundy, like it, it's I, but it just, it's another thing to add to a busy ass shoe, right? So, um, I feel personally like the cream laces on these really make the uh, midsole pop and it just brings the shoe together as a whole, especially if you take this jacket thing off, like this lace jacket thing off. I'm not a huge fan of it. It's a cool like concept and stuff, but I'm just not a huge fan of it just because it covers the tongue where it has the nike air branding which i really like and yeah just not a fan of it honestly one of the things i can solely say from travis uh was i don't know just not a fan of it so yeah that's a way to style them uh makes the shoe a lot more wearable for sure with different fits and stuff so there y'all go get a good look at that got the ykk zipper right there if y'all can see that Inside the shoe, you got some plaid on the insole all throughout. Nike branding here underneath. Got the size tag right there with the QR code looking all official and shit. Zip these back up real quick. Uh, same deal going on the left shoe. I mean, you got the pair, the other pair of laces that came with these, which is the navy blue laces. You guys can check them out here. You see that navy blue um i mean again you can throw those on there too but i feel like it's the same deal where it only matches with one specific area of the shoe instead of the whole midsole that goes around the shoe right so you get a lot more matching if you wear the cream laces and it goes together with a lot more outfits even just simple stuff um than if you were just wear these it really only goes with this and if you're wearing this on it, I guess it goes, it kind of matches with this obviously, but at the end of the day, you're not gonna see your laces anyways if you're wearing this thing on, so who cares? But just my thoughts and opinions, y'all. You can let me know in the comment section down below what you think, how you style these shoes. Because this is very, this is 100% a 100% of very like divided release where if you, you either hate it or you love it, like it's, a, it's just that simple with these. So there's the left shoe. Course, same deal man even with me trying to like keep it quick with these videos these videos are still banging out like 10 minutes man and I'm not even trying to do that because I don't make ad revenue on these I don't I don't I don't know if you guys get ads for some reason on my videos I don't think you should because I don't have any of my videos monetized even though I have the ability to do that I just don't do it like I'm not trying to make money off this YouTube shit I'm just doing it so you guys know where to buy from at the end of the day because there's a lot of sellers out there you might be unsure of so i'm just showing y'all what you might get from specific sellers that i find to be good so there's this side you see stitching just on point all throughout so solid shoe 
Solid shoe, solid build for sure. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much it on these. Cactus Jack, Air Force One, Lowe's. Let me know what your guys' thoughts are in the comment section down below. With all that being said, though, I'm going to enjoy the rest of my day off. Hopefully, I'll enjoy the video. More heat on the way. I'll try to be a little more enthusiastic in my videos. Just when I got to do three videos consecutively, I lose energy pretty quick, especially if I'm trying to, you know, like, enjoy my day. Like, my one day off that I have in the week, right? So, hopefully, y'all understand. Let me know your guys' thoughts in the comments down below. Drop a like on the video. Show some love for your boy. More heat on the way, of course. Stay blessed, y'all. Talk to y'all in the next one. Peace. Thank you.